Millions have read his book, and now Don Piper's story is being made into a movie. The movie is um, it's kind of the logical conclusion. People can see now what we felt, uh, what they read about, and it'll be portrayed very well by some very fine actors. Stay tuned for a sneak peek of 90 Minutes in Heaven when we come back. Well, he was killed in a car accident. He went to heaven, and then he came back to life. This fall, the story of Don Piper's best-selling book is being told in a major motion picture. And recently, our Angela Zatopek visited the set of 90 Minutes in Heaven to bring us this first-hand preview of that movie. It's a story that's captured hearts around the world and addresses the question, what happens after this life is over? Don Piper's famous visit to heaven is now being resurrected for the big screen. In 1989, Don Piper's life changed when a truck plowed into his car head on. It broke every bone in his body except his right arm. His heart flatlined for 90 minutes and he was declared dead. The wreckage caught the attention of Pastor Dick Onorecker, who pulled over and felt led to pray over Piper's body until the medical examiner could arrive. I need to pray for the victims. And he says that to one of the police. I, I'm a pastor. Can I, I like to pray for these victims. And the, um, the policeman said there's no one, no one to pray for. Everyone is okay except that man in that car over there, the red car. He's dead. He didn't make it. After numerous attempts, Honorecker got permission to enter the car. Sitting under the tarp, he began to pray. And uh, Dick is singing that hymn, What a Friend We Have in Jesus, after about an hour and a half of praying. And uh, suddenly I start singing it with him. I was back. It's a modern day Lazarus story. What happened in those 90 minutes? The moment the truck struck me, I was standing at the gates of heaven. Piper says he remembered his visit to heaven in vivid detail. He knew then that he had to write about what had happened. Don's turned his experience into the best-selling book, 90 Minutes in Heaven. Now the film version will bring the story to audiences in a whole new way. Well, on a personal level, the movie is um, its kind of the logical conclusion. People can see now what we felt. Uh, what they read about, and it'll be portrayed very well by some very fine actors. Hayden Christensen from Star Wars plays Don, and Kate Botsworth, seen in Remember the Titans, portrays his wife, Eva. I love that he refers to her as the real hero of the story because um, I, I do believe how she held it all together with such grace and patience and dignity. Um, is, you know, certainly a huge aspect to the success of his life and their family's life. The cast also includes singer Michael W. Smith and some new faces to the big screen playing Don and Eva's children. I play Nicole and I think heaven is like the perfect paradise and you can see people that you haven't seen in a long time and it's an amazing place to be. Piper describes the gate of heaven as much like the inside of a luminescent pearl filled with dazzling light. The gate stands ornate and large, but the entrance is narrow, just for the entry of one. I saw colors I've never seen before. I uh, saw, uh, heard the angels, not only their voices, but their wings. I, um, I heard the music thousands of songs at the same time without chaos. Only one song uh, distinguished itself among all of those, and that was Holy, 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 because he is. The person that has gone through this, gone through the challenges, uh, had seen heaven uh, for 90 minutes, was declared dead on the spot, um, and, and then said, okay, what am I going to do with the rest of my life? And I think, uh, I think that's the, what attracted me to it. The filmmakers are aiming for a story of hope, showing the power of prayer that will make audiences think 
about what's important in this life. Angela Zadapek, CBN News, Atlanta. My, it makes you want to see it. It makes you want to leave and go there. <laughs> Let's not hurry, I suppose. <laughs> yeah. It's supposed to be pretty special. This fall. Yeah. <laughs> Something to look forward to. Yes, indeed. Well, coming up.